We are at 1161 Willow Springs Drive, the Will Hoyt residence. We have a two-story hip-style roof with 30-year laminated shingles and a predominant pitch of 812. We've got six-inch gutters. There are no gutter guards. We do have drip edge and we do have synthetic felt. We've got weaved valleys and standard shingle over plastic ridge vents. I'll show you some overviews here. This is the left being the north that is a right obviously being the south as well as this the back being the east and the front being the west storm related damages we do have five wind damage shingles down here uh, at that tarp I'll show you that momentarily I wanted to show you some of this markings on specifically the right slope there's a lot of grain loss here at first glance it could be misconstrued as hail impact uh, due to the lack of collateral damage and mostly the lack of anything on the hip ridges anywhere there's not a single mark on any of the ridge shingles I would say it's Definitely grain loss could potentially be a manufacturer's defect. Didn't didn't get good adhesion with the um, grain during the manufacturing process. But it goes all the way into the corner and then comes to a dead stop. There's not a single mark anywhere on any of the other slopes. It just leads me to believe it's inconsistent with hail. Uh, we do have several cracked shingles on the ridges I don't know this one's got a dent as well I don't know if somebody's been walking on the ridge vents or what but several cracks and uh, also on the hip ridges we've got some cracks we'll go over the back now back slope shows some of that grain loss as well but again comes to a, a dead stop right in the valley no marks any other slopes here's one of those correct shingles on a hip ridge I think maybe somebody's been walking up and down these because there's denting along with it here's where we're applying the tarp uh, there are five wind damage shingles underneath it I've got these nails in loosely so I could pull it up and show you the wind is blowing pretty hard. We've got a storm blowing in right now, so I had to tack it down. But here are the wind damage shingles. They, uh, when I got here, were flipped up like this, and they are exposing the felt. This is synthetic felt, but it is fully exposed. So I'll flip these down and then I'm going to finish tacking this tarp in after the video. Wanted to leave it undone so you could see in there. There are no other storm related damages. We are at 1161 Willow Springs Drive, the Will Hoyt residence. We have five wind damage shingles. There are no other storm related damages to this roof. And that is everything that is on this roof.